Expo 2020 Dubai is a very important opportunity to engage uh, firstly uh, with our friends here in the UAE uh, but also of course with the great global audience that will be part of Expo 2020. This was something that was always going to be extremely important for us but in the world that we live in today as we uh, hopefully come out of pandemic and into better times the chance to uh, re-engage with the world uh, from this great international hub, this great city that is Dubai is something that we were determined uh, not to miss and we are uh, very much looking forward to engaging in, in a very positive, a very uh, active way. For us, uh, international solidarity is very much uh, the theme uh, of the moment. We very much uh, see this as an opportunity uh, to ensure that the conversations around uh, sustainable economic recovery. This is going to be a tremendous venue uh, coming at a really important time. So um, for us, uh, this is a huge priority. Our theme for the pavilion is very much Ireland, the island of inspiration. And uh, this evokes the great Irish tradition of creativity. We will be bringing our visitors uh, right up to date with uh, modern developments, whether in terms of technology, allowing them an opportunity to see Irish creativity in the arts, in crafts, in food and fashion and so on. So it, it's for us, it's a, this is a, a wonderful platform uh, in order to, uh, to reach uh, a very important audience. What we are uh, reminding everybody is that our journey of creativity began a very long time ago, that our ancestors, even 5,000 years ago, uh, were doing some wonderful things in terms of looking at the sun and enjoying inspiration and enjoying learning from that. Uh, and that tradition is very much part of our DNA, it's very much part of what Ireland is and what Irish people have to offer. So we hope that uh, our uh, Oculus and that very interesting design that we have on our pavilion will evoke that. And that's something that we are, we're particularly proud of. We were very conscious in designing uh, the pavilion, which was done by Irish architects, uh, that we wanted to very much present a, a fusion, a combination of the Irish and the Arab tradition. And uh, so as we talked about the, uh, uh, the oculus and the, the evoking our great historical uh, sites, uh, we were also very conscious that from the Arab point of view, the uh, cloistered garden uh, is itself something that uh, evokes a, a very strong uh, Arab tradition. These, in many ways, symbolize, represent uh, that uh, sense of friendship and openness and understanding uh, which marks the uh, relations between the Irish and the Arab worlds.